right now you see all 33 legendary weapons in the game guys okay so i could go s rank and just put the the best legendary of each category or each weapon type and then the second best and stuff because it's not just what is the best weapon in the game i'll go best of each type okay so starting with ars what is the best ar in the game i guess it's uh faraday right so i mean because it's just too good in pvp i know nico is really popular and stuff but i think because pvp players use faraday a bit more i would put like faraday over nico right and then um and then nico and gen 9 i guess would be just super good but just a little bit i mean and type in the chat if you don't agree with stuff but i think uh like gen 9 is just a, a faraday but just a little worse right and then nico is freaking good ambra i guess i like it and i play with it often it's not a bad weapon it's just not as good as as nico and uh gen 9 but still ambra is a good weapon right and then ambra mark 2 is also good and what we got uh mega megalodon is pure trash and edestis i guess this is where the controversy begins i know some guys like edestis i know it's got lots of ammo it's got decent damage like nico but it's less accurate and it feels weird and it's not so beautiful embra and embra 2 they look much better than freaking it that's just the best i hope i didn't forget oh yeah hey guys i forgot the freaking slate dauntless this is the worst legendary in the game maybe so i guess i'll put it like here because this is a burst also but still, it's all ARs, right? So I guess we'll rank the the SMGs. But again, I will put the best SMG in S tier. But I don't agree that it's as good as Faraday. But it's just is the best SMG, right? So the best SMG, I think you guys will agree, is um, Winter Mute, and then it would be Plasma Blaster. And then it's going to be tough because, well, this one I really don't like. The burst one um, is just, I, I never use it. I guess the D tier is stuff I never use. So Insurgent, I'm not saying this shouldn't exist. It's just collectibles. The D tier is during the inventory, you want them all because, because it's legendary and you want to collect them but they just sit there and you don't use them now it's gonna be tough with kira and liberator i think liberator is better than kira because well because all the stats but also the ammo and everything and kira is just right there with adestus like i don't use them but it's not pure trash that i never touch so i guess i would say it looks like that for now uh, shotguns, it will be tough because uh, there's only three legendary shotguns, guys. Do you think we're gonna get new legendary shotguns soon? This is the one with the least. Am I forgetting something? I hope not. We have Firagini, Sing Song, and Nebula, right? Okay, type in the chat, guys. Which is the best shotgun in the game? Nebula or Sing Song? Firagini will be, will be here. And then sing song or nebula i guess it will be personal see we already have two different uh answers in the chat three guys say sing song two guys say nebula nebula hits hard it's got crazy damage from close range it's really good but the sing song's got high fire rate and on my personal rank that i did earlier Nebula is slow, but it hits hard. I did place Nebula on top, and I did place Sing Song second, like that. 
but it's also personal preference. Some guys really like Sing Song over Nebula, and some guys really like Nebula over Sing Song. So I'll put Nebula on top, but maybe some of you guys will play Sing Song on top. But I'll still leave it there for now. Uh, now we're gonna be with the secondary weapons. And again, it will be personal preference, but I prefer Rev over the Heretic. But I know some guys prefer Heretic. And then it's gonna be tough, but I think uh, Pal Driver because of the, the high damage. And I also want to place the Chaser at the same rank. Because I, I like to use both. And I will place the Idolin last at C. Just because the low ammo, I don't like... I really don't play Eidolon much. I know it's dealing good damage and stuff. But I end up never using it because I'm always looking for ammo. Like the small clip size, the low max ammo cap. So I I think Eidolon is at the bottom of all the, the machine guns. But it's not pure trash that I would put it on D rank. But still, I think Heretic and Revenant are a, a notch over Pal Driver and um, the Mew Chaser 89. So you would place two tier S uh, machine guns, like, like you would do that because they're both top notch. But I still prefer Revenant, so it's personal. I cannot wait to see you guys' ranks. I will share the link and stuff later. And you guys can do your own tier list and share on Discord. But personally, I prefer Rev. And like the A tier is really good. It's just I wanted to put only one of each on S. The best AR, the best SMG, the best shotgun, the best machine gun. And uh, like look at the weapons on A. It's it's most of these weapons I use. Like the Gen 9 and Nico I really like. And shotguns I rarely play. But when I do, I like Sing Song often. And Heretic is super cool. But SMGs, I don't play much. All right, Rocket Launcher. Uh, if I'm not wrong, the Bestier has got better stats, huh? Let me just check again because I forgot. But I think Bestier is the best, right? Bestie has got the same damage, same fire rate, but more accurate, 22-20. And uh, range 80-77. So yeah, Bestier is a bit better. Bestier and then Slate Shitstorm. And that's it. There's only two legendary rocket launchers. Now Sniper is going to be tough. Yeah, Bestier's got better stats. So we only have two rocket launchers. Next up, I'll go with the Snipers. And pretty sure most players will agree that the Cryonic Scream is the best sniper in the game overall. Right? I mean, people use it more, and I don't play Sniper as much, but I think I like La Croix second, because it's got similar like fire rate, accuracy, good damage, and, and then I guess I'll place both OG and the new one, because I know some guys play them. Yo, La Croix looks better, like I agree. But I think Kranik has got a bit of an edge. But best looking Lacroix for sure. If we place legendaries on their looks, it will be a completely different list. I can do that later. Uh, a lot of guys say Lacroix over Scream, but Scream has more ammo. And I think it's got, like, you gotta look at the stats, even though I don't play Sniper as much. But you need to, like, the stats, they mean something. Cryo. Let me look again. And Lacroix. I will equip Cryo and compare with Lacroix. So Cryo's got 11.79.50. And Lacroix? Okay, Lacroix's got more damage, better fire rate. But I think Cryo's got better everything else. 34.76, 40.78. So, like, Cryo is more accurate, better range, and more bullets. Lacroix only has 5. And Lacroix is rarer. Yeah, okay. Uh, you get a lot of... Okay, I might change my mind, guys. You got so many... So many arguments. 
that La Croix looks better. It's harder to find. It's got more damage, better fire rate. I said I changed my mind for La Croix and Creo. Because La Croix looks better. Then um, OG and Ghost Rifle are pretty good in PvE also. And I decided to put the Patriot on C. Because it's really slow, but it got good damage, so I don't know. It's good for PvE. I don't see people using Patriot in PvP anymore, but maybe I'm wrong. So I'll leave it there. And then we got the pistols. And for the same reasons as La Croix, I will go with Last Ten. Because it's well balanced, but also it's super rare. And it looks cool. And then I guess I'll go Spectrum. And the other three... I will just put at C. I don't use I don't use um, pistols in Shadowgun Legends like ever. But personal preference, last ten is good. But then I'll put all of the others on C. So that is my tier list for all all the legendary weapons in Shadowgun Legends. So I'll post on Discord later my tier list, the link, and you guys can do your own tier list. Everyone is using Kestray right now, though? Oh, uh, really? Well, not me. <laughs> okay, then we'll, I'll bump Kestray a notch just because everyone's using it. But I prefer Spectrum, seriously. Kestray, you guys like it? Well, not me. I, use, I don't use pistols anyways. So if I equip a pistol, it's just because it's cool. So I would equip the last tent because it's rare or the Legends pistol. This is my Shadowgun Legends tier list. I will share the link later, guys.